Hey guys, it's Ishi Fishy here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make the background of photos transparent. So as you can see here, I have my Facebook like button here because I'm going to make the background of this transparent. So this is literally one step long. All you do is you click on the magic eraser tool and then you just click the part which you want removed, which I want all of this removed. So I just click on it and then it's just transparent. But that's not just it. You have to press file, save as and you have to make sure it is saved as a PNG because PNG supports uh, photos with background that's transparent so always make sure it's a PNG and then you press save and then you press OK and then you're pretty well done for an image like this so what I'm going to be showing you now is how to make the background transparent of more complex photos so the first thing you're going to want to do before you do anything is right click on your background layer, press duplicate layer, and then press OK. And there you have your background copy. Always make sure while you're making your background transparent that you always have this background copy layer selected. So after you do that, click on the quick selection tool and then start taking out the background which you want taken away so make sure while you're doing this you do it slowly because you don't want to accidentally take away uh, parts of the uh, image that you want to keep so but you basically just do this for all the parts of the image you want to take away So after you had selected your image, press the delete key on your keyboard. And then click this icon on your original background layer. <clears throat> and as you can see, part of your image is now transparent. If you had missed some spots of your image which you want to take off, you can just click on this, click outside the image, and then go on this tool called the background eraser tool so over here you can choose what size you want uh, the erase the erase tool to be and you can also pick the hardness and the spacing so after you've done that you just click away and then you take away part of the image that you want away so I want this part of the image away so I'm just erasing this part over here So after you are completely finished with your image, you do the same thing I said before, you go on file, save as, and then you can just name this Panda, and once again, you have to save it as a PNG, and then press save. And then you are done with your transparent image. But once again, if this video helped you, make sure you leave a like on it, subscribe, and leave some feedback in the comments. Thanks for watching, bye.